So um, I think it's time for Podluck. It is time. I think it's time. I, I think, think time. to start, we're going to talk about something that we need Hollywood to... If you to could stop listen, doing. If you could listen, Hollywood, just come here. I'm going to put a bunch of, of slides on screen. We're going to go through them Hark. one at a time. <laughs> and I'm going to just ask you guys to please, if you're watching, I know that Hollywood producers... Of all uh, of all walks of life are watching. We all know that oh, Amber yeah. Heard is a is a huge fan of this podcast That's because correct. she wore black one day so it's to try. Yes, yes. So Hollywood, what we need you to do, uh, we need you to stop telling us how long the standing ovations are at your stupid award show. Yes, and even if you don't stop, please stop rounding up. <laughs> at least from thirty round seconds. down. I want you to be a bit more humble. If so, it's if it's a three minute and thirty second applause, it's three round minutes. it three down minutes. to three minutes. Not four. So, so people already think that you guys are self obsessed and um, love uh, love the sound of your own voice and can't wait to pat each other. Like you all, uh, I imagine that aside from all the plastic <laughs> surgery, there's a lot of rotator cuff surgery from patting yourself patting on, the, on back. the back. So what I want you to do is uh, we're gonna look through these articles. Just so imagine this, that their hands are raw and bleeding at the end of these standing the sacrifice ovations. Sacrifice they make, but I, they I, keep I going it. for the sake of the craft. Colin Farrell it. lands rapturous 13 minute standing ovation at Venice for the Banshees of <sighs> Inisherin. Please. Then we have uh, this was my other favorite part was <laughs> the Banshees of Inisherin receives 15 minute standing ovation. I want to know who the hell rounded I, up by two minutes. No, I, I heard that the David Cronenberg film coming out got a 13 minute long standing ovation as people stormed out of the film while it was not over yet uh, because it was so. Uh, just Gra artistic, yes. and, oh, but graphic and it's so deep. <laughs> it, oh it's God. surreal. It's just like I'm just such an artist, I'm bro. An I just I right can't now. stand cinephiles. That's yeah, gross. Uh, if you it, casually like movies, that's different. I will say that there is the argument says like uh, it's one way, place where music and film is different. Is like no like people that hate on other genres of music. Thank there's you. never somebody's like, oh, you like comedies? What a loser. Uh, whereas like there's definitely there's a dude somewhere who loves speed metal who's like do metal god you suck Ugh, like that's, the that's, a, that's there's a, there are snobs everywhere true so true. Trace uh, Lissette gets 11 minute standing ovation at Venice Film Festival I want there if you're gonna keep doing this turn it into a game show where like yes. every, the whole year you follow the cast of these movies getting made and the only like they get progressively worse and even more <laughs> detached from reality because they're like we don't care about uh, like impressing people like normal people it's just the people who go to the venice film festival and i want them to like hand out comfortable shoes so that people will be in like uh instituted to like stand longer and maybe special gloves so that their hands won't get red from or there could be dummies like oh, robotic yes. clappers yes and uh -huh. then uh, it says, I made my colleagues clap for 13 minutes like they do at the Venice Film Festival on Jezebel. What? And here's my uh, Brendan Fraser cries after getting his six minute standing ovation. He actually has a claim. He made a huge comeback in life. Uh, his uh, was <laughs> The tweet I told you earlier uh, is... I'm sure Brendan Fraser appreciates being treated like a three-legged dog that's, all the time. That's what it feels like. Yeah. And, and then, he, <laughs> and, and then we get this one: Why standing? Why counting the standing ovation minutes at the Venice Film Festival needs to stop? Who is tasked with counting the minutes and writing down each time? That sounds terrible. Is there a sounds guy? like you could easily fake it. Yeah. And. Uh, if you all. think about Don't Worry Darling's mere three minute standing ovation, Ooh. yikes. Does three minutes. That's damning so for the, the film. If the movie has a 45% on Rotten Tomatoes and that equates to a three minute standing ovation, is there a way we could do the math that tells me how long the standing ovation of a. Uh, if a movie is, gets you six minutes, does that mean that that's mm -hmm. a 88%? We I'm lost sure you Mary. could quantify this. We lost Mary. We lost the camera, uh, camera. Shut off. Yeah. Uh, you might Mary's have, living oh no. in the darkness. Is my audio still it. here? We can still hear you, I think. Oh. Everyone's so sad. I knew in this the was going to happen because I, I was like, hey, the there's a red light, light flashing. And I was like, it should be Hopefully fine. it's nothing. Yeah. I don't know why I would assume that a red light would be nothing. I so I was like it, it might it's be a the flashing battery. red light. Well, I mean, it probably obviously. means something bad. <laughs> I love a mysterious Mary. That's amazing. Maybe we can just leave it like that and I'm No, I'm I think just a if ghost. we plug it in it should be good, but I can't back. tell. We're I'm back. back. Woo! Yeah. Hello. I'm 
I'm sure you missed me. She's a ghost. Her ghostly voice is like she's still with us. <laughs> <laughs> she is still with us. I died and I came back to Pop Culture Crisis because I wasn't finished. She was she standing ovations. I'm not done. That's right. <laughs> She wanted to stand I a few minutes standing longer. ovation for fixing that camera issue. Okay, all right, we all gotta get up. Let's go. Yay, you yay. You with your barely functional There we go. Hand. There's Mary. Welcome back, Mary. I'm back. It. Welcome I'm back. Glad. I'm we glad. missed you. <laughs> she was with us in, in spirit. In the darkness. So to <laughs> stop counting the minutes of film festival ovations, uh, it says, here come, comes Brendan Fraser's teary-eyed response to the six-minute ovation following Whale, nipping at the heels of the six-minute-plus Tar of I, I don't know how to pronounce that T A R but there's like that the symbol the little the, thing on it oh, I okay. I don't get standing ovations at film festivals so I don't know how to pronounce that I'm not cultured enough so. yeah T A R it says but wait Timothy Chalamet's cannibal romance bones and all bones and all eats it away eats it away with its lead with a stunning ten minute explosion and banshees of Inishir and gets twelve minutes well I heard twelve minutes I heard thirteen minutes I heard fifteen that's minutes that's right you just gotta round up you just round 15 minutes is like my feet hurt. That's, That's pretentious. Like torture. That's pretentious. Like, it's it's really weird. It's sort of like group hallucinations or group delusions. No, and, and what it is is the like the more progressive you make the movie, it's like the first person to sit down is like, I don't want to be the guy who it's I don't yeah. want I have to post a black square. I don't want to be the bad you know guy. What? So they just standing keep... ovations are actually ableist. Yes, because That's not everyone point. can stand Great during point. the ovation. There was a dictator. Excuse me, I forget which dictator it was, but he would kill people for stopping clapping. This is the vibe. It's, it's North Korea vibe. vibe. It's struggle sessions vibes. It really is. It's like, not cool. I now I'm picturing like okay when I picture the person who like is there counting, he looks like the Monopoly. The Monopoly guy. He's got the monocle. He's uh -huh. got the top hat. He's got a stopwatch. He goes like this. He's got the mustache. And he doesn't just count how long the ovation goes. He takes notes when somebody sits down and he, he checks their name off a list. And then they're put on a, they're on a special list. Like who sat down first? Uh, and, and then there's the two people battling at the end to prove they are the most pure of heart by just continuing to clap until their That is hands the definition of a struggle out. session, guys. This yeah. is something this, Stalin did. This one uh, blurb about Tom Hanks where he, uh, during the Elvis standing ovation, looked out at the crowd with a wry grin and gradually stuck his thumb in the direction of the movie star, Austin Butler. The applause increased on cue. Yep. It's creepy. Yep, they, that's Cute controlling applause. the crowd. I don't like that. You well, might as well just have the a studio yeah. audience <laughs> announcement like, stop clapping, Actually, start clapping, the best clap thing, harder. The best thing that could happen is like next year somebody brings like an audio file that just plays a looping clap sound yes. and then like nobody can prove no you wrong. No one has to show up. Yeah, that's, you just play it for like 45 minutes. <laughs> that's, uh, that is that is beautiful. So um, if you were to, how long do you think, if you made a movie, Mary, how long would the clapping go? I would say no clapping allowed. No clapping allowed, period. Be Nothing. a hipster. I love it. Uh, Yeah, Mar Mary would be if like. If you clap, you get kicked out. <laughs> I love it. Complete <laughs> silence, nothing else. We're just gonna show some respect. For That's right. Well, I want just one big <laughs> clap from everyone at the same All time. All in like unison. a thunderclap. Yeah. yeah. Boom. You know, yeah. <laughs> applause used to be foot stomping in the Coliseum era. Yeah, or, let's bring that back. or because I'm deaf in one ear, everyone can can do oh, uh, yeah. ASL clap. Jazz hands. Jazz hands. Yeah. That's uh, or because I'm happy. You know what else? It is ableist. Literally to have a standing ovation because some people are noise sensitive. Yeah, That's true too. Oh, yeah. Do, you, do you remember and they're that? They're gonna cause them to have panic attacks. Do you remember that hilarious video from like the, the, the Democratic? Yes. Socialists? I was hoping to just allude to it yes. and not actually Amazing. mention the Democratic socialists. Hands. I don't want they're them to come for us. They're so great. We <laughs> appreciate and respect their work. I yes. do. They yes. really set the bar. Yeah, this, love it so much. They have their own like uh, <laughs> like uh, pan like room like a. Uh, set aside where you can go into for your standing ovation with like maybe they give you or maybe they hand you earmuffs yeah 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 before yeah, like something special yeah, yeah so i really um agree with the conclusion in this article though they say for ovations to provide any intelligence around the future for a given title we would need a litmus test that can determine duration against overall appreciation for the director stars and the audience's desire to be seen appreciating a significant movie. Yep. And finally, whether or not it's any good. I also need to know another thing. I, I saw th 
it's it's like he's a 10 but he claps every time a plane lands <laughs> no it's that and if you four. clap at the end of a movie in theaters yeah Oh, please. Because the people who made it aren't there. Not who are you there. clapping you know for? That? Are they here with us in the room? Right if Tom, now? Ha- if Tom Cruise was uh, not there at Top Gun Maverick, I still would have clapped. I don't, I don't Did you clap? No, I didn't clap. Oh, I you was see, say, even, how dare you? even with Top Gun Maverick, which you loved, you didn't clap because it's obnoxious. It's uh, it's oh my god. It's just fantastic. It's just fantastic. They might as well do snaps, like slam poetry. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Yes. Let's make the standing ovations more like slam poetry and see how long that lasts. I kind of, I think what I want now is I want their, I want to hire a studio audience for our show that claps every time we finish just to make Mary really happy. Yes. They don't have to stand, though. They can just clap in their seats. That's fine. Uh, Lydia, if you were to make a movie, how long would the, the ovation go? Um... I would like a two minute ovation and then you can sit down. Modest. Yeah. Just just want like a couple minutes so that everyone can appreciate me, but not for too long. I've just always found standing ovations super uncomfortable. Well, the fact is we've all been in one. Yeah. And I hate it. It's like being in a group chat. Let me out. I want to sit down yeah. now. I want to stop talking. Leave me alone. I'm, it's a, fine. I'm a group chat lurker. Yeah, you I, are. I, I know. I, Proudly. I I'm, <laughs> yeah. I'm just like, I don't have anything to add to this. I like a group chat with like three or four people. Yeah. That's, that's, that's about the limit. The uh, anything past that. And I'm like. Nah. It, is my insight really that profound? Like I don't think I have anything I don't think it to is. say. Yeah. I don't think it is. You know, that's the hardest part of doing this job is it's like, do I have anything profound to say? Does that matter? These are questions that may or may not need to be answered. <laughs> what I've found is that you don't always need to provide the most profound insight. You just give people something fun to listen to. Yeah. Like crapping on stupid celebrities that's for right. standing up and performatively clapping when they probably would rather be doing anything else. I know this is the wrong platform to say it on, but you don't always have to say something. We are podcasting, so we necessarily have to say stuff. Technically, I do have to say stuff. Like, yeah. Fi- I'm at, yeah. I, you know, yeah, like, uh, there's always obligated. a time and place, yes. though. Thanks for watching this clip, guys. If you want to see full episodes or follow us on social media, links are in the description below. Bye. Bye.